Um, I came to Fox the year after my best friend passed away in a car accident. I came in in a really, a position of just feeling lost. End of my sophomore year, I had figured out that my grandpa had gone to the doctor and we had been told that his liver was at less than 5% functional. A buildup of those problems of not being able to help my family, not knowing what I was doing here. Um, in a sense, I wasn't doing well in academics as well, and I wasn't performing as well as I wanted to in track. It was like the world just pushing me under the ground. It's hard to be vulnerable. I tend to be the person that people are relying on, and I think for a long time I have felt you know what, it's my job to be the strong person. It's my job to make sure that like nobody can see the chinks in the armor because I'm the one that's being relied on. Spring semester of junior year, mom and dad decided to go out on a, on a free form trip. When they came back that day, they told me that, that they were thinking of separating and they were together for almost 25 years at that point, I wondered how God could let them think that way, that they could let it end like that. It was hard getting adjusted to being out on my own, and so kind of having to make that and figure out how to find people who supported me through that and who I could share those pieces of myself. I just sat down in the car with a couple friends and just told them everything. And they just sat there and they just listened. They prayed over me and they thought that God could make a real difference in my life, that I could be able to put some of the weight on his shoulders and not go through this pain alone. The music faculty have just been so amazing, watching out for me and making sure I was okay. We're built for community. Like God created us to have community with one another, not to be isolated and alone. And so I, that night I decided, hey, let's try it. Before bed, I prayed and I said, hey God, I've never tried this before. I don't really know much about you, but I'd love to get to know you more. And I just want to take this first step. Originally coming into Fox, I wasn't religious in any sort of way. Coming here, I did feel like a, some type of spiritual guidance. Every time I was on campus, I would always get so many different highs. Hey, how are you doing from people I didn't know? I was, I would say I was very like introverted and coming here with people being so outgoing, I had to force myself to be more introverted and get to know people more. Community has been something really consistent all four years here. I really found this community to be very special and dear to me. My dad and mom really made an effort. They decided to make their marriage work for, for both me and my brother. And their marriage has been stronger than it ever has been. But they are so happy right now and so thankful to God that they're doing so well. I know in a sense now that I'm not alone, that he's always here with me and whether I do face these hardships or not, it's not because it's a punishment, but it's because it's something that I know that is gonna help me grow in the future. I'm feeling too weak. I have a community that I can go and ask for help. I can show up, feel like I'm really tired. I'm really weary. Like, I feel like I can't pray for myself right now for whatever reason. And can you pray for me? Through all the good times and the bad, you know, for concerts, during when all that family trauma was happening and working on projects, my friends and faculty in the music department, you know, they, they, they really are one of the best parts of my time at Fox. If I could say something to my freshman year self, I think it would be to not take things so seriously. Live in a way that brings you joy because it's gonna be okay. And by the end of this time, you want to be able to look back and say that you made the most of it and that you lived and you experienced joy and that you built relationships and that you leaned into the hard things, but you leaned into the good and you went on the adventure instead of staying home. And it's a short time, it goes by fast. My name is Esther Reitzma. I'm a psychology major and I'm from Newburgh, Oregon. My name is Owen Tembrek. I'm an interdisciplinary studies major in music 
an audio production for Sam Arts, and I come from Dundee, Oregon. My name is Abigail Torres. I am a theater major. I am from Peshastin, Washington. Yeah, so my name is Andrew Quach. I am a graphic design and marketing major, and I am from Arcadia, California.